Hey what's up guys, it's Kim June here 6138 and welcome to another tutorial. Today it's going to be on or about how to make a basic introduction or outro or something using Windows Movie Maker with some really basic stuff on the internet. So what you want to do is make sure you have Windows Movie Maker, whatever version you have, I don't know, 2.6 is the best for this computer, you know this computer's not too great. So open it obviously and Go to your internet browser or Google Chrome, I recommend. Then go to movie to movie tools info and go on the free downloads. And then what are you doing? Then go to the free downloads. And then you'll have all these loops and stuff, so click on the one that you want so let's have these orange ones or yellow ones whatever you want to call them slow motion loop so download one it will save it as a a uh, WMV file and it is Windows Movie Media Player playable and it's a really nice just normal clip and there's no sound to it so once you downloaded that and it's in your folder and wherever you'd like it uh, if you want to use the Windows Movie Maker font that it already gives you stick with it but if not go to simplythebest.net forward slash font and it will come up with a list of fonts and you can select the different fonts you'd like so Beverly Hills got um, it's a little more complicated this bit but um, you guys will handle it it's a zip uh, file so you know what to do download it unzip it to a folder but you have to unzip it to your font folder in the users on your hard drive on your computer alright so and then it has to be on it has to be in your phone folder though. So once you've done that, go to Movie Maker, open it. I've already downloaded one, so we just click import video and import the clip like this. It's normally called SD something. Drag and drop. Uh, come on, don't freeze. Don't freeze. Okay. Uh, even though it says it has audio, there is there is no audio, so you can put your own audio in. Uh, go to make titles or credits. Please don't freeze because it normally freezes when I do this. Please don't freeze. Ah, oh, it's frozen. Alright, guys, well, while it's waiting, you know, uh, my computer's crap. And um, yeah, there's loads of loops and world spinning and like numbers counting down, so you could use some for your top uh, 10 plays, or you know, you know, you can make it as an outro or a, a slide in a slide or something like that. Alright, here we go. So we're going to go make the title on the selected clip and then type in your username or whatever. So, once Kim June hit 6123, change the color and the font so that you downloaded or vice versa. So let's go modern. Underline it, make it bigger, whatever you want to do. Let's make it full loop. Yellow. Alright, so it's not a nice color, but you can change that. Go done and then drag the text where you how long you want it to play. Click play and then this is what you get. Don't lag. There you go. Obviously the font will look a lot 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 better when you do it because you can set some nice font and whatever. But that is just to show you what you can do. So yeah, that's uh, how to make a basic intro or outro is the same thing. You can put as much text as you want in and you know do what you pretty much want with it. So Alright guys, that has been another tutorial on how to make a basic intro using Windows Movie Maker or outro. And I'll see you guys in another tutorial.